10 Rules of Investing by Richard Dennis Richard Dennis was born in Chicago, the author of the popular stock exchange strategy Method of Turtles. He worked as a messenger on the stock exchange and earned his first million by the age of 25. He was a shy person in his life, he was never married and lived with relatives. In investing, he was a fan of his business, was not afraid to go against established rules and had his own view of the market. He considered discipline and the desire to learn to be the main condition for success in the market. Richard Dennis has collected 10 rules for successful investing. The first rule. Start with small volumes. As a beginner, make moderate bets, because at the beginning of your career you are very weak as a professional. At the very beginning, I earned $40 a week working as a messenger, while losing $40 an hour trading on the stock exchange. The second rule. Stick to the trend. A pronounced trend is the main condition for a deal. It doesn't matter what strategy you use to determine the best moment to enter a position, as long as it guarantees getting into the trend. The third rule. In case of failure, always stop trading. At the very beginning of the journey, I lost 30 to 50% of the deposit only because I decided to continue trading after a 10% loss. From that moment on, I realized that if the situation develops according to a destabilizing scenario, the best solution is to close the deal and do something abstract, go for a walk or go to bed, do anything to get a break before making another decision. The fourth rule. Avoid stereotypes. Trade has taught me that the majority opinion should not be considered as something natural. The money I have earned proves that the majority is often wrong, and the vast majority is wrong even more often. Markets with their crazy crowds are almost always irrational. And where emotions are over the edge, there are always a lot of mistakes. Fifth, the key to success is discipline. Most traders believe that if a strategy becomes available to everyone, then it will no longer work, I don't think so. If you do something right, it will work, despite everyone's awareness. I say you can print the rules for successful investments in newspapers, but no one will follow them. The key to success is consistency and discipline. The sixth rule. Have a plan for all occasions. There is a moment that, in my opinion, is very important. You should always be prepared for any extremes and surprises in the market. It is necessary to take into account the implementation of the worst scenario, keeping in mind a ready-made plan of action for an instant exit from losses. The seventh rule. Take a closer look at the basics they will always work. Working only according to the trend, focus on longer trend segments, entering a position with the first signs of an upward trend and exiting with the first signs of a reversal, gradual increase in transaction volume while the asset is confidently moving in the right direction. The eighth rule. Don't become a hostage of the strategy. Traders often become hostages of certain trading rules, unreasonably choosing only a bullish or only a bearish model of behavior in the market. This is not true. Both directions should be worked out in the same way, without psychological advantages over each other. The ninth rule. Don't stop thinking. The habit of recording the course of thoughts in the decision-making process, analyzing them, helps to increase the percentage of successful transactions. When your business is bad, there is a temptation to hide your head in the sand and rely on chance. Working in the financial markets is really a very stressful process, which often causes one desire to forget about trading immediately after the end of the day. Tenth, always stay cool. I was able to learn to avoid the temptation to recoup by catching up with the trend, averaging or doubling positions. If the deal turned out to be wrong, there is no need to try to change the situation by force. Composure is a crucial quality of a trader.